Asalaamu Alaikum, okay, another vlog. Um, if anybody wonders why I always do this when I'm driving, it's because, hello, I'm a single mom, I don't get time to, like, you know, be organised and all of that. Anyway, so we're on our way to the museum, and I think it's really important that this is part of an education for the children, really, and myself. Apparently, there's a copy of the Quran in the um, Kalam exhibition and I want to speak to my children about the fact that the Quran has actually been preserved for a really long period of time mashallah so I'm hoping that I can look at this page and be able to read the Arabic from the page inshallah so we'll watch your space and I'll let you know how it goes all right <laughs> Okay, so mashallah, here we go. These are the 7th century Qur'ans. Okay, so I'm here with Rebecca Bridgman. Now, you're the, you know, creator of the actual exhibition. How's it been? It's been fantastic. We've had a brilliant response from the communities in Birmingham. The last, at the last count, we've had 30,000 visitors, wow. um, and that was last week. So it's been really busy over the last week, so we're hoping that we're going to be almost up to our 35,000 target by the end of the exhibition. Yeah, and what's the feedback that you've been getting on some of the art, art, artefacts that have been here? Um, we've had some really positive feedback. I think a lot of people have come to see the old manuscripts, the Quran in particular, that's on display. That's one of the oldest and most complete um, copies of the Quran in the country. But then I think people have been amazed also when they come in because they've seen a lot of contemporary art um, and pe people have been interested in that as well and maybe that surprised them a little bit. Yeah. So I think, you know, the great thing about this exhibition is that it's been right through from the ninth century, sorry, the seventh century to the present day. So yeah. it's covering lots of different types of calligraphy. So, yeah. um, end of the day, how did you find it? You owe me a fee. I'm doing my own filming because apparently my son now wants to charge me a fee for doing video camera in. She's, my mum's looking at it's 65p. I'll charge him. I'm going to pay him with... How much? Didn't I'll you want to go to uh, McDonald's? <laughs> oh, blackmail. <laughs> oh, that is too much. Good parenting. Get your seatbelt back on. Okay, so yeah. Um, join me on my next vlog. For well, I don't even know what's going to happen on my next vlog. I just randomly do a vlog. I think, hey, let me share this with the world. Hey. Peace. Peace. Comment. Follow, yeah. Comment share. how much you should pay me. My mum should Send pay me. me. Please do.